Let me know when. Just let me know when to say it. Go. Live from live from Defera. It's the Dark Mom Consortium with your host Mom. <laughs> with your host Mom. Well, I could go with your host Fleet Moogie. <laughs> I like that better. Fleet Moogie is good. Hang on one sec. Okay, okay go ahead. Live from Defera, it is a Dark Mock Consortium. If your host, Fleet Moogie. <laughs> I like Fleet Moogie, yes. That's a good name. So, uh, as I was just telling you a moment ago, uh, the transport's still stuck. Gosh darn it. Uh, well, they supposedly fixed it, but apparently they didn't. So, randomly, it's going to go stick on you. It seems to apparently. stick at Alpha, too, every time. Apparently, they need to fire a helmsman. <laughs> I just really feel bad. I mean, I'm standing there not doing anything because the whole thing is you then have to let the synth destroy it. And I'm telling myself the story of the poor captain of the transport and all the people who were just beamed up from Mars thinking, oh, we're going to make it. And they have to stand there. They can't move. They're getting beaten to death and they're getting the word back from us that we can't rescue them. And they're having to, you know, they've got that last few minutes to realize it's all going to end. Oh, what a sucky personal story that is. We torture the hell out of people. We do. I mean, look, come on, just make it swift. Don't make it so horrible. Or if we're going to make it horrible, make it bad people at least. But, oh. Well, they were the bad people. They're the ones. We you have to rescue me. I'm important. It's a transport full of Karens and Chads. Yeah, the Karens, the Karens and Kens on there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hi guys, yeah. we're giving you back down to Mars. Well, yeah. Oh my well, God, that's even worse. Yeah. So, so let me guess. Uh, Ken dumped Barbie and went with Karen. <laughs> that what the deal is? That could be it. Yes, that's pretty good. Yeah, the whole. Uh, Ken, Karen, some out here they're called Chads instead of Kens, but yep. Well, I've, hey. heard, I've heard Kens, I've heard Chads, I've heard... I've heard, heard Kevins. All sorts of, I've heard Kevins too, yeah. yeah. I but, mean, there's no real proper name for them <laughs> other than an annoying little... Oh my god, you yes. Would, I think I would rather go with like an early army thing. You annoying maggot! You don't even deserve to be around! Okay. Um, yeah. Sounds good. Sounds Let me good. hear your war face! <laughs> you know? Yeah. My war face? This is my rifle, this is my gun. Oh, that's not it, Aaron. Yeah. Yep. This is, this is for fighting, this is for fun. Huh. Also, hey, folks. Hello. Hello, Zor. You're up Yo. late. Yeah, my situation changed a little bit. Oh. I can once again stay up a little later. Okay. Well, I'm glad to hear that for our sake. I hope the situation's a good one, though. Yeah. Um, oh. Okay. Yeah. Let's let's just say it's uh, it's a good change. Good. Glad to hear that. And, it, and the rest you can discuss after the stream. Okay. <laughs> well, I am so gosh darn tired the past few nights. I wasn't feeling well last night, so I went to bed like at eight. And of course, what happens? I wake up at one. Of course. Yeah, and so my body's just going, come on, go to bed. No, no, if I go to bed right now, I'll be up at one again. That'll be me on Saturday, no matter what time I go to bed. Yeah. All right, no. Oh, you don't have to work tomorrow. Okay, you can be up now. No, I don't want to be. 
Let's see, how long did the Romulan military report it would take to evacuate the home world? Hmm, always a good question. Longer what than that you did? I'm assuming we're going to com we're comparing Mars to Romulus. No, we're comparing the uh, uh, questions from the whatever the heck this is. Oh, oh. Those questions. And I have my hey. cheat sheet, so I don't actually care. Uh, it's six weeks. Six weeks. Fault. Six weeks to evacuate a billion people. That's freaking fast. Yeah, it is. But the other options were like three days, seven days. Come on, guys. If you're going to have a gem Hadar, give him his gosh darn Ketrasol white. Or Maybe. get through the whole thing so he doesn't have to have his Ketrasol white anymore. This guy is just standing here. I see somebody all the time just doing the, oh, I don't feel good. Uh, let's see what I got. What's in the box? What's in the box? What is in the box? Ooh, thousand of lithium. The lithium's oh. good. The lithium's, the lithium's good. Lithium's good. Won't say no to that. The lithium can well, be. I prefer good. the ore. Prefer... The, the refined. Yes. The refined, not the yeah, ore. Yeah, refined. That would well, be nice. Yeah, but... Yeah, I th yeah, that that that's got to be the single most frustrating thing about this game is having to wait for your dilithium. Well, on my other account, I keep yeah. forgetting that I have to process it because it's not a uh, yeah. Oh free yeah, yeah. Or it's yeah, free to play, so you can play a game. Going every day. Yeah. yeah, and I'm there every day. I just don't think about doing it. Okay, I gotta do sixty ground vaults. One harvest material on the ground, and then 150,000 polaron damage in space. Oh, I guess we have some stuff to do today, then. I this, sounds, this, this, sounds, this sounds like a job for the Dominion. <laughs> I have to destroy 16 destructible torpedoes. Ooh, I think we've got to do some crystalline catastrophe for that one. Uh, uh, crystalline catastrophe, yeah. It's the easiest way to tar start targeting every freaking shard you can get. <laughs> yeah, I had, I, I, I've already done mine, but I had Undine ships, Phaser Space, and Anthropods. Hmm, that's not too bad. Yeah, when you yeah, consider Anthropods are a bit to, annoying. Yeah, when you consider I had to go to Nimbus anyways, not bad at all. Yeah, absolutely. You're, you're there already, so go for it. Yeah. After damage on the ground, that's easy to do. <laughs> so what do y'all think of the new episode? Is that, like first it. of all, before before we go any further, somebody was, played it yet. Yeah, somebody was kind of going, don't tell us, so let's make sure. Is there anybody out there who hasn't played it yet? Yes. Okay, well, we shouldn't okay, spoil we'll it for you. Keep everything a secret. We'll okay, it all, all secret. I will say is, I liked it. I liked it. I liked it. Oh, yes, I liked it a lot. I yeah, actually yeah. was a little bit disappointed with the new TFO. Yeah, it's still kind of <laughs> buggy as heck, but... I, I don't mean the buggy part. I mean, that's just cryptic. That's too expected. Um, no, what I mean is, it's a TFO that is severely time gated. Well, it's strictly yeah. time gated. I mean, I don't think there's any other it's aspect a, to a it. Pure, a pure time gate, and on top of that, it caters almost entirely to mobile, very mobile ships. Yep, it yeah. does. Um, yeah. yeah. If you cater to mobile ships, don't time gate it. Uh. But, because Honestly, essentially, I... those are the opposites. Those are the, that play fast ships don't want time gated stuff. They want to go through the TFO fast. Those that play f slow ships don't mind the time gate. They like standing there and uh, simply uh, shooting stuff for ages. Yeah, but you you can AFK it if you want to. If you just want to complete it, you can just AFK it. As, yeah. as long as your team's okay with that. Yeah, that's I, even worse. Actually, actually <laughs> you, don't, you don't even need a team to AFK it. Apparently, you can solo it and AFK it. Yeah. I mean, just set your ship to automatically return fire, sit somewhere in the middle, and uh, have fun. Yeah, the thing about yeah, but AFK kind of makes people unhappy, so... Well, as long as everybody's okay with it, but as DT just said, you can do it as a solo AFK. You okay, can actually well, play it solo? Yeah, apparently yeah, you can you do it as a solo. You can as Cuba's private, you can play it solo. It's probably a bug that they'll fix, but what the heck? There you go. Gives you a chance to take out, you know, your Ba'ul sentry, set it up, and just sit there. If yeah. you don't care about saving anything, just camp. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm kind of a mobile Ba'ul sentry, but yeah. 
I get what you mean. So I, I'm actually enjoying it just because it's different. It's not just shoot, shoot, shoot. So I, as I was saying, I do my little personal story. So it's how many of them can I rescue and get back to safety? And, you know, doing these fun little yeah. stories in my head, which makes it a little bit more enjoyable than just your basic pew pew. Yeah, definitely. It's um, kind, of, kind of a different challenge. I, I don't care for the outer ring collapsing thing because this kind of reminds me too much of um, other games that I don't care for. Um, for I like, I... Yeah, yeah, exactly. But I like the uh, the old saving the people thing. That's just different. yeah. I, yeah. I'm, I'm also mechanic. a fan of script of scripted death stuff. Scripted death stuff. Yeah, I mean, just get outside of the uh, shrinking circles. Boom. Okay. Yeah, because if you're outside of that, that circle too long, you, you die, basically, ah, right? okay. Yeah, like, yeah. there's like a five-second timer or something like that. Yeah. yeah, please don't make it a timer and script it death, just make it increasing, uh, increasingly higher damage. So that you can go out for a moment and then return. Maybe yeah. save the uh, last couple trips before they blow up. That oh, sounds it cool. Hit, uh, it took like, took like three hits to kill one of my ships when I was trying to get it killed. <laughs> it's not this... instant death. It's just it's, not, it's close enough. I don't find that the synth are particularly damaging to my ships. I don't even notice them. Yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, they're I doing... Notice. They do damage on the uh, transports, except for the last one. That last transport. Oh my god, I don't know what they've made those shields out of. But it uh, sat there for over five minutes today. And synth I, is just... The synth yeah. ships are just target practice. Yeah. Well, I finally told yeah. everybody in the group, just don't you know, move away from it and let the synth get it, otherwise we're going to be here forever. And it still took five minutes. It doesn't take five <laughs> minutes in a real game to kill my ships. That's just a little piddly transport. It's like, they put it it's this like, way. Oh, I'll tractor the trans. Give me an option. Yeah, yeah, I that would be it. You know what would know be fun? Hmm. If we, we, if they do something, we they use this sort of glitch in there, you got you're doing the evacuation while the transports breaks down. And you have to actually tow it. To, you have to tow it out. Yeah, that would be fun. Yeah, or, or, or either tow it, uh, tow it if you got the tractor uh, beam skill equipped. And mm -hmm. If you don't, then beam the people aboard and uh, bring them uh, back to the station. Yeah. yeah and actually, you don't want to bring them back to the station. No, you have to bring them out with you. That's fine. And I'll take them out with me. It. They can. Yeah, either one. I'll duct tape right. them to the outside of the hull. We'll be fine. <laughs> Yeah. Not recommended, but okay. <laughs> as long as I'm not in the atmosphere, we're good. Yeah, I guess it's well, all, as long as not you outside, yeah, you're fine. Yeah. Or simply repair the, uh, let us repair the ship, let us heal it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I mean, give us like a bunch of options on what we can do with it. Or we can do like no. we do with the uh, Drenur Colony, put a cover shield behind it and just bump it. <laughs> but you can't do a cover shield in space, that's kind of the problem. Uh, Alpha's got a question. What is that torpedo you can damage yourself with? Uh, there's a couple of those. Plasma you can damage yourself with. I think, you can, I think you can damage yourself with the trilithium laser. Really? Yeah, you can. Yeah, I think, you can. Yeah. I think, yeah. I think it's got like a big blast radius thing as far as torpedoes. Yeah. Um, I believe the new spatial charges can also damage you if you happen to be in this vicinity of them. Hmm. Interesting. I think that's what Timber was saying last night. Say that again? I think that's what, what Timber was saying last night ah, in the stream. Okay. If you shoot them off in a torpedo spread and happen to like be flying through them at full impulse, they can possibly damage you. <laughs> Which... That's a sad day. Yeah. And I turned made a mistake of asking him, why did you fly through your own torpedo spread, dude? And yeah, you didn't like yeah, that. Question, that that's a good question. Dared me. That's... Oh. Yeah, but the answer to that is I'm simply too fast to control the ship. Yeah. And unfortunately, that's the answer, answer that applies to a lot of people. Really, is the answer. It's like I screwed up. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Famous last words. Oops. Or what do you mean it doesn't uh, have any more gasoline? You mean oops and oops did it again? <laughs> oops, as in. Oh, I forgot to put uh, fuel in the airplane. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. 
okay. Um, what do you mean you forgot the gas? Yeah. Elf says, "Wonder, uh, would it work on the glitchy transport?" That's an excellent question. I don't know. But darn, um, if I'm not going to try it tomorrow. Because that this is old day. This is old days where you can self-destruct yourself. What did I miss oh. regarding the transport? There's a transport that gets stuck at the Alpha Corridor in uh, the always. new TFO. Not always, Not always. But enough that at some point you realize it's stuck. And you all have to back off and let the synth just kill it. Which is not fast. So we're discussing other ways to kill it. Or tractor it out. Or heal it. Or put a cover shield behind it and bump it. <laughs> or buff the so they can do it faster? Yeah, there, there's, yeah. No real, there's no real cover shield in space, which makes that a problem. Yeah, I understand that. It was a metaphorical cover yeah. shield. Y you know, there's a part of me thinking, okay, just go down, sit right next to it, and, you know, draw aggro and let him go for it. Yep. Do something. Thank you. It's very annoying. Yeah. I always think that... Uh... Cryptic makes it that he was also a bit too linear. Doesn't allow us multiple options for solving the problem. I, I pre would prefer if they simply put the problem in front of us and then let us use the tools that we bring to solve it however we like. Blow up the enemies. Well, it's, it it's pretty hard question. to evacuate a ship when there's no real skills that will let you evacuate a ship. But they could oh, create the way, something. I'm sorry, Pike. Did you see the did you see the post regarding the new Alienware giveaway in yes, the starter pack? Yes, I, I did, I did. Did everybody see the, that? Uh, nope, oh. hand, it, hand it over all. <laughs> Hang on, let me see if I've got it still. Nope, I don't have it still. Uh, boom. This is the lobby. This is the lobby. Let's see, Boom had it on earlier. It's here. I found it. You found it? Okay. We go throw on the stream, so... Alright, let me find the real link then. Yeah, I tried it earlier, but for some reason, uh, the login screen for the Alienware thing... Uh, when I clicked on login, nothing happened. Um, double check that you're not missing a letter, because when I logged in, it was missing the final A from giveaway. It, it didn't, uh... Tell me that uh, I typed the wrong username or wrong password. It just didn't do anything. Oh, okay. Mine came into almost the right screen, but not quite the right screen, which was annoying. Star Trek Online bundle giveaway. By the way, Cryptic, I love yeah, it when what? you randomly just, you know, unequip all my traits at once. Thanks. Yes. Yeah, well, yeah. it's it's everybody. We're all appreciating that at the moment. Yeah. Are we though? Are we really though? Elite Services Starter Pack. Well, I already have one of those, but you know I can always use hey. another one. Yeah, it's free. For, for, for odd reasons, I haven't been hit by that trade slot thing. I hit by it so often. Per account, am I right? Pardon? In their defense, in their defense, it was only my ground traits and my starship traits that got dislodged this time. So basically, almost everything. Yeah. Well, no, because my space trait stayed there, so I... Whatever. Yeah, Ed was saying that his sixth trait, or whatever the, the new one is that you add, keeps yeah. coming undone. Yeah, do uh, that to me, too. Yeah. Just maddening. I'm sure they'll, they'll, they'll fix it, you know. Mom, have yes. you, have you thought the Universal? Do you want to team up for that? <laughs> yeah, that was a hard one today. Yeah, I need help that one. That if I... What is yeah. Universal today? I haven't looked in yet. Academy lore. It would be my pleasure. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, well, you definitely need a team of five with some good weapons yeah. for that one. Yeah. yeah. Can we yeah. take it on elite, maybe? Ooh. No. That's a no, fun thought. Least, at least too hard. Sorry, bye. Elite, you gotta uh, carry your books there. You can't just use the computer that's right. terminal. That's right. Okay. Today's lore question. Yes. Who agreed to finance the reconstruction of the Cardassian in? Industrial complex. Quark, Golmerat, and La Grand Nagus Rom. Rom. I would Rom. say Rom. But I can look it up if you want me to double check. Let's say Rom. And it was correct. It was Rom. Yeah, yeah the others just didn't sound that. like. Yeah, no. Not if he wasn't getting a share of it. Back thing. Oh, Rom is actually the 
actually not the greedy one. Quark would have been greedy. Right, that's why he wouldn't have financed it. Unless there was something in it for him. Yeah, that my traits on this guy has not been reset, so that's good. You're that's sure? Even... Yeah. Oh, okay. So look at my traits. The thing that's going on is everybody's got to reset their skill trees. It would be my skill pleasure. trees also. Complete. No, look down in the lower right hand corner. Does it say? Does it say invalid? Oh yes, it does. Yeah. Yeah. Have fun. At least mm-hmm. your old one's still there. So if you liked it, you can just take a screenshot and go from there. Yeah. So they're not going to fix it? No. Well, they did fix it. They did fix it. They gave everyone a retrain token. They did fix, yeah. Yeah. Everybody a retrain token, so... So you get to respect for free. Really? That that sucks. uh, Russell, you have, what, two tunes? Ed has 40... It sucks with one. I understand (laughs) that, but Ed's got 47, so I mean... So, really, you get a free retrain token to retrain your spec. Yeah. Yep. That's how they fixed it. To uh, yeah. add to my 17 retrain tokens I already have. Yeah, I know. I've got so many well, respec they, well, tokens. They basically, oh, they, basically, they redid how things save for better use later. That's the reason why. Sorry, but yeah. that's big BS. It kind of is, but it's also kind of understandable. It, it, Bitch, bitch, bitch. Well, no, no. It was the easy way to fix it. It was their easy. No, I'm, I'm not. I'm not bitching, but but I'm just like. Uh, let's, but let's I'm bitching. <laughs> no, they break it. They fix it. They did. They did. The problem is that the, the fix invalidates the current data structure, so you have to reset the data. It's the oh, retrain yeah. token. Yeah. It, it's okay. It's not a fix. They're executing. It's a fix. You're executing. We break it, well, you fix it. <laughs> that's just part and part of my French, but that's BS. That's not Sorry. Hey, I'll take BS over some of the things people say. Well, it could be worse. Could be. It can always be worse. Yeah, yeah, Perfect. absolutely. I'm not gonna fix it today. I'm gonna no, fix it. I'm gonna fix mine this weekend, maybe. I'm trying to remember what my what are we fixing? The uh, the spec trees, yeah, skill it. trees. Yeah. yeah, skill trees broken. Everyone's skill tree is broken. Yeah. If you look at your skill tree and you see an invalid skills, see you gotta fix it. down here, invalid skills, but it's got the retrain right next to it. Yeah. It resets everything, let, so you can go back and play. Right quick. Okay, what does this one do? And then I have to retrain. Oh, that's what. Do, and uh, uh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> we are all we are all very happy with with that solution. <laughs> well, I liked hey, it because it gave me a chance hey, to respect I've, some stuff. I've done like fifteen characters today. Oh, you want to you want to compare here? Not comparing. Just just join the join the complaining club. Well, according to Mewson, they fixed the Phoenix Prize. Oh, yep. Good. Yeah, I claimed it on one tune today already. I got it. I I, it on another. I'm beyond even remembering that there was that. It's one of those. Yeah. I don't care at the moment. Yeah. There we go. Oh, wait, I actually did that one. I was doing all the skills. Yeah, I only did the skills on the character I'm playing. I'll do the rest when I get there. Yeah. <laughs> it's not like I don't have about 30 respect tokens of yeah, my own. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> well, no, yeah, I, <clears throat> yeah, I think we're another 12 or so as well. <laughs> but I'm happy I got the ship upgrade. Uh, token things from the exchange before they went up in price. Holy what are they now? The last time I checked, they were like Welcome 57, 59 Your million, 60 Whoa. million. <laughs> Ow. I, might, I might have to buy some because yeah. I need DC. I might have to take all yeah. of mine and sell them because I've got 24 of them. Yeah, well, I bought mine at 45 million DC. Which I felt was okay-ish. 
in my mind. But yeah, they've gone up so much. I'm like, mm, maybe I should wait a little longer and sell when they hit 65 and there make 20 million profit on See? each of them. Very Ferengi of you. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna Why, go buy, you. buy some of that. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. Ooh, I, I need a set uncommon. of Ferengi teeth. Aww. Oh. Alright. My endeavors are all done. Wow. Hey. Well, almost Halloween. You could probably just buy those plastic vampire teeth. Those will work. Mm, not really. But. I guess. No, they're kind of thingy. Let's see. Uh, you can't sell the ones from the Phoenix Prize Pack. You can only sell the ones from the Zen, Zen Store. store. Yeah. store. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. Because uh, it just. Well, right now it's a two for one deal. So one ultra rare gets you two upgrade tokens. Which isn't right. bad. No, it's not. Which it's techno means really that you good. have an epic that gets you four tokens. Right. Well, I've got five epics, so that would get me more than a few. Yeah, that gets you about 20. Yes, it That's would. It's like most of your fleet. <laughs> it would, and I've got three regular ultra rares. Didn't you have more ultra rares, like, two days ago? No, just these three. Are you sure? I... I'm sure. Okay. All right, 13, so 26 in total, yeah. Yeah. Actually, uh, if it's yeah, two no, full, I, yeah, 26 I, in total, you're I, right. I, I was like in my head with the math, but wait, like two days ago I calculated you could be getting 13 of them, so, yeah. uh, uh, uh. Right, but it's but two for it's one like right now, so. Two for one, so 26, yeah. So this so that's why I thought you had more ultra rares. Uh, uh, Mike, if you mean your shields are weak because your skills are effed up, yeah, that could well be. It's does not the, your fault. This, is it all tunes or only a set of tunes that can be? Oh hit wow! By? Say Pi that hit. again, Pi. Is it all of your tunes or does it hit random? For what? The skills in Valor. No, it's Everybody. all of your tunes. Everybody. Every, Every tune. Oh, yeah. No Every exceptions. Every tune needs a reset. Yep. Yeah, but as I understand it, they changed. As I, cha as I understand okay. it, they changed so, the uh, way the so server handles how, the data on the background. Yeah. So how One at a time, do we yes. get the free train token? Pardon? Uh, is... In your ship uh, view, the, there will be in the right bottom corner a free retrain button. Right. So it's right here if you're looking at your screen. Skill yeah. invalid you gotta to, you gotta, you gotta do a ship selector. Oh, so I have to go. So I have to go to the ship selector. No, right. I didn't yeah. have to. No, that's that's only for unlocking the X yes. token yeah. on the ship. But for the retrain, you, you can do it any place. Oh, oh, you're talking the skill retrain. Right, yeah, skill, skill retrain. retrain. Yeah. At the bottom. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. don't you have to have a token, or are they? No, just no, it it's you just click the button. Got it. Oh, okay, okay. So, That's what I was wondering. Yeah, I was going to say, oh. you, before you do anything else, though, if you're going to respec it the same way it is, take a screenshot, because once you hit the retrain, it all goes gray. Okay. Now, I pretty much was lucky I had made screenshots. Mm -hmm. And I even tweaked my skill tree when I did, taking out uh, some of the shield hardness mm -hmm. to have more hull regen on that. Yeah. I guess that gives you a chance to play with it. Well, should we play something, folks? Sure. Who's got Anna? anything? Who's got something left um, on endeavors they need to do or whatever? I got destructor damage on the ground, harvest materials on the ground, and then destroy destructible torpedoes. Well, that sounds to me like we're going to start with the little crystalline catastrophe. So, X up. Um, are we going Fed or are we going KDF since this is yours? Uh, I'm limited to Fed because I haven't reskilled my KDFs yet. Reskilling. <laughs> All right, X up if you want to do a little crystalline catastrophe. Oh. 
I character. would, but I need to reskill first. <laughs> so I turn oh, the next people. one. I'm yeah, changing the next characters, one. and I'll go on with you. So okay. So we're doing fed then. We are doing fed. I'm okay. gonna I'm gonna go take La Serena out. La Serena. Shameless plug. I need to watch two Twitch streams right now. All over. Friend of mine got started this week. Hey, congratulations uh, to your friend. Yeah, Ooh, it's Macho she's Camacho. A, she's a singer, so she'll Ooh. be playing guitar and huh. maybe doing some requests. Nice. Yeah, it's uh, it's refreshing to see somebody actually bring some art to Twitch mm -hmm. rather than uh, the recent bands have taken away. Well, I've been watching a interesting cooking show on twitch i was watching an interesting body painter on twitch and apparently they're no longer part of twitch oh yeah yeah well yeah I, i've seen a couple of those it makes me wonder if they're old enough to uh, no 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 no. this person was old enough but yeah, well, um, i mean i saw one that i kind of wondered if she was even out of high school or not she looked really young I, wow. I, so it's that I, possibility but the fact that they're showing off body parts is another factor yeah, but this person was doing, like, real art body painting. So, like, Mystique for the X-Men movie. I understand that. But the and fact that they're still like, showing off body parts is a no-no for Twitch. Well, uh, well, and, well, if you look at all the body painters, they're covered up before they even begin. Yeah. yeah. But there's a new They don't ruling. show nudity. It's not no, nudity there's... because they're covered. Okay, but there's a new rule for streamers on Twitch, women oh. can no longer show under boob. And because, yes, the bits are covered, but under boob was visible. Oh my they God. They got banned. It's not and new. It's like, I'm pretty sure there's some parents arguing uh, about that. There's been a ban wave on uh, female Twitch streamers who showed too much this uh, past week. That's oh. crazy. Bollocks. And good evening, Mr. Dave. How are you doing tonight? We have I room for one more person. A, I forgot to take a screenshot of my personal traits and my ground traits and my starship traits. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Well, thank goodness no, it's only your skills, not your traits. It's everything. Oh, oh no, yeah, your okay. traits are done, too. Oh, your traits got on? My traits well, are fine. When, when, when your, starship, my... your starship traits get undone when you respect, so... Uh, all mine did for me. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Boy. For me, it was the uh, personal and Starship. Yep, but no. the reputation yeah. still stayed. Yeah, starship? I still, like, toggle the reputation ones on and off. Okay. Yeah. No, my when I retrained yesterday, all my skills and all my traits were off. I had to wow. redo all of it. No, I'm looking at mine. The only thing I don't have here is the new um, experimentals, which I haven't done yet, so I'm not going to worry about them. But everything else is here. Ground, space, starship, space rep, ground rep, and active. All valid. Not here. When I hit the retrain, boom! Ooh, yeah. Ouch. Everything went away. Did all your traits go off, or just some of them? All of them. Oh! Yeah, okay. Personal ground, personal space, and space trait. Uh, starship yeah. traits. You got the same oh, thing yeah. I did then. Yeah. Yeah, same as here. Wow. That's what I expected. Wow. I expected that... some of my traits to go away. I didn't expect all of them. Was... Yeah, my traits didn't go away when I respect this morning. Some of mine went away, some of mine haven't, but I, like I've been redoing everybody anyway, and I got yeah. like yeah, skill cryptics. I got been skill... having all kinds of situations, haven't they? Yeah, I got a skill planner up, and I've been kind of saving stuff as I go. So, Well, three T5s isn't bad, Mr. Dave. I've only gotten one T6 out of all of my Infinity Boxes. Hmm. Yeah, I've had better luck getting T6s just buying them off the exchange. The, the second box I've ever opened, the second lock box I ever opened was a T6. Oh, <laughs> the second uh... one. I haven't seen one since then, but my second one. I remember it was the Sona lock box, and I got the... Oh, my and I got that. I got that Sona science vessel. Oh. I got I got a car way back when the Cardassian Gilor from a lockbox. Uh, 
then when I was doing the TOS tune, I really wanted to get the Kelvin ship because it was the only way to really get a T6 Connie at the time. And I think when it, I think it would, I think when it first went on the Universal, I got it. So <laughs> lucky. Yeah, really. I have room for one done. more person if somebody wants to join us. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Let me put an X in chat okay. right quick. I want to put an R. I, I, that was Mike who put an R in there. Okay. All right, so we have a full team here. Is everybody ready for me to cue this up? Sure. Because yeah. sure. okay. this may take a few minutes. Because there's another... Five others. I think it was more than five people. Yeah, that it's a five this, and five. Yeah. So yeah, after hearing you guys, I'm kind of glad I decided to wait before I tried out this experimental. Yeah, slot. I'm. I'm waiting for everybody to uh, tell me it's working just fine. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm not. I've not had any problems. Think about what now. ship I want to use it on. I think I'm going to do it first on the Kittimer and then on the Morgu because uh, if it applies to count wide, that means did, those uh, two will I be my, open for everyone. I did my Morgus today, the fleet ones. Mm-hmm. Did one, the other one is up, upgraded free, like they said. I have a giant yeah. bug on my mouse. Uh, I've, I've done Lost Serena. Pardon? Uh, I've done Lost Serena. I've done my legendary. I've done a lot of my legendary ships. There's like one more I want to do, and I've done the Brielle over the Klingon side. Okay. The fleet Brielle, which is. The fleet, which is the, t which is the core, of course. But when, yeah. You know, I just put this Omega, uh, this Omega suit on mm -hmm. my character. I didn't realize it was shiny. Ooh, shiny. Yeah, it looks like a silverfish. Wee -woo. Okay. Yeah, I have a fair number of T5s, Mr. Dave, that I got. Yeah, and I then, got lots of T5s. And unfortunately, I'd love to give them to my other account, but you can't. Not after you open them. Well, I haven't yep. opened them yet. Uh, but because they're uh, lo uh, infinity, they're bound to you. You can't sell them. You can't give them uh, away. You, yeah, you can pick the ship and then send it over. Oh, well, that's a good thought, then. Unless you're talking mm -hmm. Phoenix. I mean, it even breaks my uh, <clears throat> my my skill um, skill box or trade box below for ground when I retrain. Yeah. Yep. Phoenix I know which one you're talking about. Uh, I said some bad words. I'm just a bit tired of this game. Look at all these giant ships around me. It's because you're in that little teeny tiny one. These uh, crystal and fragments are considered targetable. targetable right. Yes. Right? Okay. Yep. Yeah. The small ones are considered to be. Uh, yeah. The word torpedoes. So if you hit the big ones, okay. let's okay. not beat them up too much, so it gets lots and lots of crystal fragments. I'll get a few of them. Okay. I think my grab will be able to grab them. Grab them. Harvest material. Got him. Yeah, right. just Murder. Space I got two of them anyway. They are retrained. Yeah, that's one to Yeah. I don't bother with the others right now. Just wanted to get one playable. Yeah, I know, but it's just... It's just they should have a backup of you two, right? So why don't they just... Cover the skills trees over to you, too. It's a different data structure. Yeah, they change the system. It's like trying to uh, fight a, a stone tablet as a book. Won't work. Or, well, a, a stone tablet as a, as a USB stick. You just, it's just not compatible structure of the data. At least that's what I assume. Though writing a, co a converter from one structure to the other shouldn't have been that hard. Essentially, they were lazy. 
Well, it would have been nice if they would let everybody know we're going to do this, so we'll go take screenshots. And just be aware that we're going to do that just as we announce a brand new episode and a brand new TFO. Or, or at least, like, send out a mail or put in and, you know, watch new in Star yep, Trek. I agree. Yeah. Sorry, guys. We, uh, we, Fubar, your skill tree. We advise you to send a screenshot, this, this, and that. And just have it ready, you'll get a free retrain token, right? Mm -hmm. Instead of yeah. people playing the game or doesn't read the tweet and then after half a year figures out, oh, it's because it's a bump. <laughs> yeah, I lost a whole bunch of traits once and never realized that they were all gone. I'm just like, oh my god, I suck at this. Worse than I thought I did. Devs could have also just reset everybody without the use of the button or the token. So that when you log in, you get like a prompt that says your character has been uh, reset and you will have to respend. Do you know how many. Have they, have they reset everybody's character without any warning whatsoever? Do you know how many complaints they would have? They would have more complaints than they have now. Um, yeah, and on top of that, I wouldn't have been able to make screenshots of my stuff before resetting. Okay, exactly. I got my, I got my, yeah, uh, that's true. Did you get them? But yep. Hey. You won't get the problem that people who haven't played in like God knows how long still having to reset. It's going to happen anyway yep. with that going on. It's. Uh. Yeah, that should at least have made it a pop up. Uh, sorry for the inconvenience. Uh, due to the uh, restructure of the server uh, of the uh, data structure for characters, we have to uh, you have to reset your skills. Um, here's a free re retain token and 500 Zen for your inconvenience. Have fun. Ooh, that would have been oh, nice. They're not going to give you a Zen. They're not going to give you a Zen. But it would have been no, a nice move. move. Or a thousand extra lithium, or ten thousand, or whatever. Something. A little something. Lithium Doesn't really matter what. Maybe one of those uh, newfangled uh, ship upgrade tokens. Oh, they did give us one for free of those. So, I mean, they yeah, gave but, us one for free. Yeah, but one for the inconvenience. How do we know they didn't do that though? That's because they didn't tell us. It's about communication, and they failed at that. <laughs> you want a new set of lungs, or do you want one, or? <laughs> nah, it's just, uh, either it's my cold or my allergy are ex uh, acting up, either one, or both. Mm, okay. I actually stayed home today because I had mild, very mild cold, but everybody in the office was sneezing and coughing, and you're not supposed to go to the office when you're coughing and sneezing. We're all allowed to work from home when we're sick. Mm -hmm. Isn't it even outright illegal right now? Not illegal, no. And Absolutely is. not. You're not supposed to go shopping. Oh, what we're where I'm at. If you're mm -hmm. sick and you don't stay home, it's a five hundred dollar fine. Really? Wow. Yeah. Uh, a friend of mine from India. Uh, mm -hmm. If you actually uh, show symptoms, mm -hmm. well, if you get lucky, you only get a night a night in, uh, in prison cell. Wow, that's a good way to not spread diseases. Yeah. I forgot where it was. I I want to say it was Korea, but. If you're symptomatic and in public, you're under house arrest, in essence, for two weeks. But they'd send you food, and they'd make sure you're covered for your salary and get you medical care, so it's a little different. In that case, I would voluntarily go out. Getting a salary if I don't have one otherwise? Hmm, say, sure. Can I, just, can, I, can I just get that anyways? I can, I can make a cough. Uh -huh. I gotta, I gotta relog re be right back, guys. Okay, okay so... Either you are destructor damage on the ground and kill Vaughn. What kind of damage uh, on the ground? Destructor damage. Ooh, we could do something that's on the ground. We could do a bug hunt. We could do. Um... I got uh, defeat Terrans on uh, defeat Terran Empire on ground. Ooh, we could do a uh, Pavo Descension. Pavo or uh, Terraknor. Or Terraknor, either one works. Hey, I'm good for both. So, have you guys heard that? Uh... No. 
the FDA is asking for emergency approval of a drug. Of a drug? Called Regeneron. Never even heard of that. Oh, that was Trump yesterday, yeah. Oh. Yeah. What the heck is well, it? Well, it's something that got Trump back on his feet in three days' time after contracting COVID. Mm. Yeah. And he says he's feeling great, so if this shit actually... Oh, I'm sorry. If Maybe this stuff actually works, have... then, yeah, Trump was right when he said in his speech he wants everybody to have access to this drug. Okay, Regeneron's Agreed. actually a company. I know. They make the drug that uh, they gave Trump, and Trump thinks the drug is called Regeneron. Okay, no, it's Re I know Regen it's Cove 2 Antibody Cocktail. Da, 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 da. Yeah. It's under a clinical trial. Mm -hmm. But since Trump has, a, you know, priority, mm -hmm. I guess, he already got the stuff. Yep. It worked for him. He's now our human guinea pig, and if he doesn't get sick from the, you know, side effects, mm -hmm. then yeah, maybe this will finally get everybody out of their house again. Oh no, because he'll only give it to people who vote for him. Well, the thing he is, it's, it's not a vaccine, well, and it only works on people. Actually, actually, Trump said he wants all the American people to have access to that drug. Well, that's when great, went, but it's, yeah. it's not meant for that. It's for people who haven't started to mount their own defense yet. So you've got to have been exposed, it looks like. I'm just looking at a really quick review of it here. Well, so essentially it's an, uh, oh, it's already too late. Yeah, here's something that's, it's, it's that a, helps, helps you over it. It's a treatment. It's not a... Yeah, it's, it's a treatment. It's not a vaccine. So having it out there for people would be great. Yeah. It gets people out of their beds and healthy enough to actually be participants in society. Not which means necessarily. I'm, I'm just looking at this. It seems to be a very select group so far that it's intended for, but it might be... Um, because of the side effects, they don't want to give it to people who, are, who aren't really, who are not really sick with it. Yeah, so it's got to be in that little period there. So, TFO? Yep, absolutely, sorry. I used to read a lot of these medical stuff things and it makes some sense what I'm seeing there. Did you see the chat? <laughs> yeah, I'm not, yeah, I'm not gonna say it. <clears throat> yeah. yeah. Though, quite frankly, I don't think that any of us is really gonna be threatened by that disease. Uh, but if you're Even reasonably if you healthy. did actually, uh, catch it, uh, we, uh, we will probably still be fine. Oh, what are we doing, by the way, before we get any further? I think the uh, uh, option was ground and uh, turns, so either take Noah or um, Marble. Well, well, give me an option of what you guys want to do, because it changes who I'm going to go grab. I have no preference. I have fine. a slight preference for uh, take Noah. Okay, fine. Let me switch over. Oops, no, not that. Let's just go over there. Oh gosh darn it. I forgot to mail in my mail or mail ballot thing today because I don't want to have to drive back to Chicago to vote. All right, who's going to run this one? So what about all those female female streamers that have hardly any clothes on? They're not going to ban those? Well, do they cover the proper bits? <laughs> well, I mean, I've seen a few. I've seen a few show a little cleavage. But oh, I've never seen the underboob. I've seen some of the a, a bit more than just a little. Yeah. <laughs> I must admit, I think it's amazing that a girl has a stream sitting her in her bedroom, fixing her nails, talking about her everyday life and her chihuahua on the side, showing almost all cleavage, and she has six thousand viewers. Huh? Yeah. I'm clearly doing this wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Rasul needs, be, Rasul, it, it, yeah. Rasul needs a webcam. He needs to show some cleavage. <laughs> 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 and
and Duffy too. We need some man boobs on stream. You see a lot of woman boobs. We need some man boobs. Yeah, there we go. Uh, so how about Papa Dissension? Can we live with that one? I can live with that one. Yeah, yeah. I can. Well. There we go. Fed, by the way. Here. Got room for one more. Oh. Hey, useless bridge officer, pick up the other guy. Come on, here you go. And Jason. Yeah, the election should be interesting. As an outsider, I really hope more people go and vote. I, I think we're going to have a good turnout this time. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> yeah, well, it yeah. if he's going to... If he's ever going to get the, the mail-in ballot thing destroyed somehow. Well, I mean, it's... Uh, it's I, I have seen too much evidence that the mail-in ballots are going to be screwy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'd, I'd love I mean, to do it online. They found fraud and they also found a lot of mistakes that, you know, quite literally tens of thousands of ballots haven't been counted. Oh, well, they haven't gone out yet. Yeah. So. Oh, well, they have in some places. For the I, I'm glad I live in a state where it's not required. Sure. I can go vote in person. Okay. So. I, I can go vote in person as long as I don't mind driving a hundred and some miles to get there and taking a day off of work. <laughs> okay. You guys we got will? a weird voting system. We will. We will. And a pop. Yeah, when I'm at home, it's around the corner, so it's easy enough. Here in Germany, when there's elections, mm -hmm. every single town organizes their own collection of the votes within uh, all of their high school, all of their schools, essentially. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, we don't so, do it. we don't do it in schools. We do it here um, more often in like the city hall does a lot of them. The churches in the area usually get used, uh, but not in schools. They used to do it in schools, and it was too disruptive to the classes, so they don't do that anymore. It's also school hours. Oh no 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 no! It's like six a.m. to six p.m. or something like that, with the majority of people going in first yeah, thing in the morning. Yeah, here, here it's on weekends. So oh wow. <laughs> yeah, it's on a Tuesday here. Yep. They use but, yeah, uh, single yeah, holes here. It's, it's usually either a community building or a church, yeah. or at least in this area yeah. it is. And hi there. You know, or or the the tax office. The you wow. Know, you, you know, my last election, I went to the church. The one before that, it was at the, it was in the building that the tax it's office. It's Don was Burrito. At. It's Don Burrito. Don Burrito's here. Hey, Don Burrito. Yeah, hi, uh, hi. Don Burrito. Okay, who's Don Burrito? Episode? Yep, just finished watching it about 20 minutes ago. No, I don't say anything. It's tonight. No, I'll see it tonight, but don't say anything till then. Yeah, I'm European. I haven't. I, have, I don't think I can see it yet, so shh. So what do you think about the uh, new mission? Haven't played it. Oh, no. Oh, oh now we can spoil something to him. <laughs> no, he's not gonna spoil the episode. Go play it. Yeah, yeah. The, episode. yeah the new episode. The, the, I'm just the saying new, you you yeah. need to watch Lower Decks. I'm it's going to. I've possible. been trying to catch it on like Thursday nights or Fridays when I get home. I will go watch it. I sadly had uh, a bit of it spoiled by Facebook, but eh, it was still exciting. Well, that's good. Yeah, just don't open Facebook or Twitter if you have a bunch of Star Trek I friends. Don't. <laughs> I don't. I don't do either one. I have one fleet mate who occasionally sends me stuff on Facebook, and that's about it. I'm going through the waterfall. I'm under the waterfall, it. too. All right. Yeah, I'm heading right. hand top left. Okay. Well, I'll I'll try to, I'm fine on my own. I'll, I'll try to hop back in tomorrow after hopefully more of y'all have watched it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, then we can chat yeah. about it. Hey, okay, well, watched what? Lower decks. Lower decks. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I've seen it. The new one though, the new episode. Yeah. Okay. Don't spoil it. Yeah, don't spoil it. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, all I say is I enjoyed the new one. Good. All right, I I'll see you all later. Well, thanks for stopping by. Peace. Take care.
Now, I honestly don't agree with uh, some of the things I hear people say about Lower Decks, because I think it's hilarious. It's not my cup of tea, yeah, but it's better than a lot yeah, of I things I've seen. The problem I got with it is, to me, um, Star, Trek, uh, Star Trek is science fiction and not comedy. So turning it into comedy no. is... But, like, I have to say... It's a matter of opinion. Is, I have this same discussion with fans of the Teen Titans who don't like Teen Titans Go. I think Teen Titans Go is hilarious because they're a parody of their se themselves. Yes, that's your opinion. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I think and it's a parody, it's totally it. fine. Well, I mean, you're not supposed to be taking these characters serious. They're cartoons. Yeah, let me put it this way. I'm fine with it as a parody, I'm not fine with it as Alpha Cannon. And unfortunately it is Alpha Cannon, or at least treated as such. Yeah, I, I know. They're making too many jokes for it to uh, be canon. But yeah, it, it should I like be it. clearly it state it's just a joke. And then it's fine with me. Yeah, it's... I don't know, it's, it's funny to me. I enjoy it just like I enjoy watching South Park and all that sort of stuff. South Park is too vulgar for, uh, for my taste. Yeah. Hey, le hey, let us remember that there was one point which Jonathan Frakes and Marina Sirtis were pitching a Riker and Troy sitcom. Yep. <laughs> really? Yep. Okay. Yep. That would yep. be that funny would for a be couple of episodes, show. but that would be tough to maintain. Yeah, well... Didn't they have one? Um, I mean, isn't this called TNG? This, no, this is where I have to lock my jaws tight. For like three seconds, or...? But yeah, Lower Decks was fun this week. Well, I will watch what, it tonight. What, it's all what, set up. What, 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 what saddens me about Lower Decks is that I cannot see it. Sorry. Legally. Why not? Because... Legally. Legally. Okay, okay, I want to say, because I have a link for you, you can just watch it. We yeah, would never promote that. We would never discuss anything Because that I apparently oh, live in a yeah. part of the world that doesn't believe in uh, getting copyright, uh, you know, buying the rights to watch it. So. Oh, yeah. No, I have a better uh, solution to that. Keep in mind that we are currently on stream and live. Yeah. Yes. That's why we would never advocate doing anything that's even slightly illegal. Well, promoting VPNs is not illegal. Well, VPNs are fine. Yeah. Absolutely. But using to watch something that is illegal to watch in your area, that's would, not so fun. Yes, we would never suggest that. Yeah, no. We can tell that it works for that, but... Uh, <laughs> neither is it illegal to dress up with my eye patch and my peg leg. Arr. Well, that actually depends on the situation. What, what, what somewhat annoys me is that a lot of these commercial for, like, NordVPN mm -hmm. and, and whatnot, they're actually promoting buy our service and you will get free and you will get access to, like, more shows on Netflix. Ooh. Yeah. That's actually illegal. Yeah, it is. They're promoting their service so you can watch unlawful, illegal shows on your own Netflix account. Or Prime or whatever service you use. Boy, that's, yeah. that's dancing a really fine line. In my opinion, it's actually stepping over it. Mentioning, there's a difference between mentioning that something can be done using a certain tool and advertising it. Yeah. I mean, uh, there's a guy here who does commercials it's, for It's like Nord. saying you can go into a bank and get all the money you want, but they don't mention it's actually illegal. No, one of the guys yeah, who just, does just work for... Just gun or a bomb. <laughs> there's a streamer who does a lot of stuff and uses uh, NordVPN. They're one of his, I don't know what you want to call it, advertisers. And they the are very strict about, hey, you use it for this, this, and this, but it is not for illegal stuff. He's really very clear about that. So I'm wondering if... Why can't I transport for once? There we go. Um, like I said, you're dancing a really fine line with not getting 
sanctioned, if nothing else. Yeah, at the very least, you're looking at a very hefty fine. Oh, yeah. What? A fine? Yeah. At the very least. At the very uh -huh. least. Because you didn't do anything illegal yourself, but you uh, uh, encourage others to do so. That's a fine line. Well, more than that, uh, uh, companies like I'm not telling anybody what. No, no, not you. If, if Nord does it, you know, if Nord advertises, you can do this to commit an illegal act. Uh, that uh, is, I, that's I, a problem. I can't remember if it was Nord VPN or, but it was one of these VPN club yeah. companies that's saying, "Hey, uh, do this, and you can." No, 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 no. You know, I'm like, wow, you're actually promoting your. Pro I don't mind if they promote the, they're the promoting a product. But it's like, if you do this, you can actually watch all the all Can Netflix uh, shows are in America if you just change your location. It's like that's illegal. Yep, it is. Um, I wonder. I mean, it's convenient, I mean, but still, if, yeah. If you're still paying Netflix for access to their site, I wonder how illegal that is. Because you're is just hiding up. your location. Which is, yeah. not, you know, here. which is not in itself I, an illegal act. I, it's when you're doing it to illegally if, watch something if, if you're, if and pirate you, it. If, if, you, if you are a European citizen and you came to America and you used a VPN to say that you're... Say to, if, you're if you use a VPN and use a European server, then since you're paying for a European service, it's legal. So and does you, that work that the other way around? If, then? If, if, your, if your account is a, is a European account, and you're in America, you can do that. It, on, and same goes vice versa. It's uh, uh, I'm really not sure kinda, about that. It, it no, really kind of... But their system will only recognize you by your speci specified location. Now, as long as you're paying for a service you're technically not pirating and it's where you start pirating that it becomes illegal so yeah. I'm, no, I'm thinking the, the they found the one. no but i think the vpn when they were advertising worded it carefully enough to not get trapped in the uh in the legal workings and just duck through that loophole okay that that's not that's not uh, going from server to server. That's a that's a public display of what you're showing. Reading Terran transporter signals near but expire. As uh, as opposed to being stated, the VPN service that was advertising this, I think they very carefully worded it so that they duck through a loophole in the law there. And I still think that it's actually illegal. Liable. Okay. They aren't actually liable because of how they worded it. Is what yeah. I think. That's what I think as well. At least if they didn't get uh, sued for that commercial right afterwards. Yeah. yeah. Um, which you might not know. Yeah, no, I'm just jumping to a outcome here, but yeah, uh, that yeah. is most Still. likely what the advertisement company did when they made the advertisement for the VPN. Right. Still, um, I think that actually the law is if. Uh, a certain product is not licensed for, for sh viewing or showing in a certain region, and you're in that region, you're kind of screwed. If you hide your location in order to access it anyways, then it's already a crime. Okay. Yeah, but but that's uh, where you are uh, falsifying your identity, which is you're not You're different. not changing your identity. You're not falsifying yeah, yeah, your identity. I'll both, I would believe that the lawyers are discussing and focusing yeah. on the yeah. Because there's a lot of like minute detail to this. Yeah, there's also a live stream going on, so let's be fair yeah. to that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking to say, I wonder what our, our viewers are thinking about all of this. Probably, yeah. Probably doing well, I, something else. I think they're going. Why do you keep talking about this? Yeah. Like I said, let's still let the lawyer. No, let's let the lawyers talk that one out. Yep the game for a while. Thank you. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let's change subject. What do people have for dinner? Uh, um, 
Pasta. Uh, bacon cheeseburger. Pasta. Hamburger. With yogurt. On the bacon cheeseburger? That's weird. No, no, no. Oh. Uh, I, uh, there's a regional chain here in Oklahoma and North Texas called Brahms. Okay. And you can get yogurt as an alternative to fries. Ah, that's interesting. Nice. <laughs> I thought I would miss fries, so, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, well, they have crinkle cut fries, and I'm not a big fan of crinkle cut fries. Me either. Awesome hamburgers. They're really awesome hamburgers, but I'm not a big fan of crinkle cut fries. What's, what's wrong with? Okay. I mean, it's the same potato. It, it is, yeah, but well, they don't I get mean, as crispy. Yeah, yeah, oh. they're thicker and uh, and they don't cook as crispy. Get yeah. Ready. The yeah, they're, 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 they're a little too spicy at times. Destroy it. And on top of that, I'm trying to get away from French fries anyways. Well, yeah. You could probably stay away from Star Trek for a while, too, but... The rumors are true. An inferior universe. Right for Congress. Inferior universe, true. my butt. Well, my inferior universe just kicked your ass, so... Fight me. There you go. You've already lost. Uh, are we missing, uh... Oh, he's dead. Yep. I got him both. Bye bye. Got him. He's still talking and we've killed him already. Jeez. Mom, I get some jokes for this today. Pardon? How did we do? We got 120 right plus now, the bonus. <laughs> just saying, That's I can't. not bad at all. Hey. I don't know how I killed 20 Voth in that. Info, <laughs> but I'm not complaining. Okay. So, everybody be quiet for a moment. Pi, what did you say? I just gave some of their flea pill to SGA oh, and okay. FSMC. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. All right. Um, last I looked, uh, Klingon Colony needed some fleet marks, but that could have been filled while I've been busy. There's one project running now in SFMC. Oh. I slotted the last deal for that. Okay. So we are on tier five of the colony. It'll be ready a week from tomorrow, if I read that right, or a week from tonight. So we should have a yeah. party. Klingon colony. Klingon colony. Drinking blood yes. wine. <laughs> wow, that is. This exactly is where we make the blood wine, and wow. we take our and we slaughter them and ferment their blood. <laughs> okay, so so. This this new event does it give you like a full set? Yes, yes. it's the yep. full set. Wow! No, pa, yeah, no, pa, you, have to, you have to do it for you have to do it twenty days for each item, or you can buy it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Twenty days for each item, and you are twenty five days to do so. Yeah, twenty. <laughs> twenty days for each item, and you got ten days to do it, right? Right, 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 yeah, right, 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 right. That's how it works. How many, how many days is this one? 30, I think. Uh, yeah, it's 20, so there's usually 27 yeah, it's days. Yeah, for today, so do you want to do it? I've done yeah, it for the day, but I'm happy to do it. I'd yeah, love I've to grab one of my ships. And, uh, if you're curious, Pi, hang on. I'm happy to do it again if somebody wants to. It ends on the 5th of uh, November. Perfect. So 30 days, right? Yeah, I was going to say, less. Duffy bought it already, so if you want to take a look at it. Of, of course she did. It's like Saab, of course she did. What does it do? Uh, weapon amplification, wow. It's essentially uh, science energy weapons. Yeah, yeah. This, this, yeah. There's stuff that'll buff your energy weapons. There's stuff when you have energy. There's energy weapons stuff that'll buff your your control abilities for science. That's yeah. Essentially, your science buffs your weapons, and your weapons buff your science. After testing it last night, I will say the clicky is not worth it. Yeah. It is clicky. a complete waste. What? What? What is? What is the clicky? It, it does a, a frontal beam assault oh. that opens up a rift. Oh, okay. However, oh. it is it is not 100% chance of hitting anything. It only fires in front of your ship. So wow. if there's nothing oh, in front of you, you're not going to hit anything. Oh, and well, it, and I've never considered that a big deal. It, I've it still takes 30 used seconds like to charge. It takes 30 seconds 30. to charge before it fires. It's a so boss weapon. For that 30 seconds, you're not doing anything. You can't move. You can't do anything. Wow. So you 30, click it, 
And it's 30 seconds before it starts firing. Well, it's not 30 seconds, but it's like 15. It's, it's, there's a charge time to it, right? Yeah, okay. Right? So if you're squishy as hell, it's not worth it because you're going to be dead before it fires. Wow. Yeah, even if you're not squishy, the boss yeah. will be dead before you fire. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The way we play, yes. Well, the, the two piece is worth it, in my opinion, for a science build. But... Yeah. Yeah. Sounds so. like the uh, the one is one is the one of the starship traits that uh, intelligence scanning or something where it scans the target before you can fire your weapon. And, yeah, yeah, it's kind of like that. Yeah, right. It takes like fifteen seconds to do something. In those fifteen oh, okay. seconds to charge, you're literally a sitting duck. It's like this is stupid. It's like my orbital strike oh, that takes ten fire minutes. Fire if you're if you're. You can't it. fire. You can't move. You can't do nothing. Jeez. Hello. Yeah, that's why so, I kind of keep going with the quantum phase beam. So, in other way, just like Doc Heffernan would say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, I will say, the rift you open with it is kind of neat. However, <laughs> getting no, to that point is just... Is, just it a... doing, is it doing the entire charge time worth of DPS when it actually uh, pops? It, it does a bit of decent uh, damage, yeah, the, uh, the rift does. That's about so it's about 8,000 per second. So it's not worth it at all. Uh, it, because it, if you have, a, say, a 10 seconds charge time, and assuming that you do a decent DPS, say 100k, so that's 500,000 damage that you missed out on. Here's what I'll say, I'll say this. If it wasn't for the charge time, it would be worth it. Yeah. Okay, and obviously at Epic, you've okay, got and, and that it's a down, is good not a time. Okay, okay. All right, what was that, Mom? I was just going to say, at Epic, it's not going to get any better than you've got it, so... No, no. Okay. Uh, the four-piece, the duration of the rift lasts longer, and it does more damage. That's it. Hmm. Oh, so it, it just depends on what you want to do that way, I guess. I think it's a nice, fun uh, roleplay set for the four-piece. And I think the four pieces, individual pieces are quite nice. It's a good but starting set, set for it. Yeah, that's actually what I wanted. I want a set that I can simply re redeem uh, early on, put yeah. it on a random tier 6, and simply have a full set. Yeah. That yeah. levels until Mark 12 or whatever. Um, no. You have to, you'll have to reclaim it every every 10 levels, but close enough. So what? Yeah. Effectively levels. And if you're 65, it starts at Mark 14. That's nice. It's, yeah, it's awesome. Like so... That, you First level 65 too, and you just hit 65. It's a pretty decent starting set. Yep. So why not I do the? You uh, already got it. You just post this in chat. I I, I just, yeah, put it up in chat for why to see. The only so, thing I didn't upgrade was the singularity core because I don't fly Romulan ships. So we got a shield, combat engine. Deflector and then both mm -hmm. the and and The only core. thing you can't re engineer is the warp core. Okay. okay. What are the mods on the warp core? Um, aux to weapons, uh, aux uh, power and power cap, and uh, EPS. Okay. Those are warp core is not a bad. In piece. my opinion, not those are pretty good uh, mods, anyways. Yeah. The aux to weapons is. Pretty nice for science build. It's, yeah. It works for the build. Yeah. Yeah, I was kind of, I was kind of looking at that. It does seem to be built for. Yeah, something. yeah. I think the items themselves are freaking good. Yeah. That's what all that convinced by the set. Well, the the two piece is decent. The two piece I'll work around, but the three piece, no, I won't bother. But anyways. So. A... There and is a certain uh, synth uh, uh, TFO that I would like to to do. Does anyone want to participate? I would be happy to. Okay. Let me switch to I will X up in chat and you can get, you throw the invites. Mm -hmm. Alright, give me a sec to get over to where I want to be. Is that where I want to be? That's where I want to be. Wanna bring out your tank? Yeah, I'm bringing out my tank. All right, go ahead and X up if you'd like to join for a synth TFO. 
Nah, I'm almost to bed very soon. So. Oh. Why? It's only 3.15. Your time. Yeah but, I, yeah, but I have to get up at 8. So. I understand. Uh, I have to get up tomorrow morning, too, because I uh, <laughs> more or less have to go to work. More or less? Well, yes, uh, my mom. My mom kind of volunteered told me to help her out at the craft show. Got it. <laughs> I got up um, crazy early this morning. I'm glad I did because I went to set up to work from home today. No one had bothered to mention that. Oh, we you have to have the corporate VPN. You can't just plug into the system. Shoot. Okay, fine. Talk to the guys in India. They got that set up. System started shutting down, so I'm having to reboot everything. I lose all my batches, and it, I'm glad I started early. That's a good thing to start early. <laughs> yes, yes. DT, you joining us for TFO? What are we running? TFO, synth. Synth wave. Sure, I'll change ships. I just one? wish there was an elite version of it, or at least an advanced one. Because, quite yeah, this frankly, will be my first time to play the TFO. Pardon? This will be my first time to play the TFO. Oh, really? Oh, yes. nice. Okay. I've been doing. I've been. I've been. Uh, I've been doing the episode out once for each of my characters a day. Or I mean, <laughs> yeah. I've been doing the episode once a day, okay. but I'm kind of alternating the characters. Absolutely. I the last project that needed fleet marks. Thank you. Yeah, I'm surprised that the fleet marks weren't filling up faster. <laughs> And I'm gonna slot some new projects because I see some projects. What else do we need? We need. Oh. A so we don't need a Who needs an invite? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so okay. we're full on. Yeah, we're full on renewable energy. I see. So it's only the green and the reds are missing. Okay. So develop. I'll show off the. Uh... I'll show off the clicky when you get in there. Projects there and race morale. Okay. All right, is everybody ready? Yep. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Wee -woo. Wee -woo. Wee -woo. I heard someone else's wee woo. Wee -woo. I heard everybody's wee woo. It's funny, I went into this earlier today, and it had already started because obviously somebody either got kicked or left. Oh. Captains, it is oh. with Solon. These are technically a pre made group. We should pre. Okay. okay, you may have to walk me through all this. So. Okay. What's going to happen is there's going to be a perimeter set up. Within the perimeter, you're going to see some little circles appearing where you can beam up engineers from the surface of Mars. Uh -huh. At the same time, the synth will be coming to attack you and to attack the transports. So after you beam up somebody from the ground, you need to take them to one of the transports and beam them over there without the synth killing you. Or your transports. I mean, you're trying to protect the transports too. That's not a bad effect. That cone, yeah. if it hits something, does 100,000 damage. Ooh, sweet. Well, basically, it's a Fortnite. Yeah. Oh, the <laughs> TFO, yeah. The TFO is just Fortnite. The circle gets smaller and smaller, and if you're outside the circle, or some of the people you're trying to rescue is outside the border, they do. The they get turning the defense so net Fortnite. against targets on Mars. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fortnite with so we have to go the So speed. if you do the external perimeters first. Just, just try and stay within the bubble. Pretty much self explanatory. Yeah. I just wish the music wasn't all synth. Uh, I've got music turned off. Yeah. There's music? Yes, it's uh, Holst's The Planet Symphony, and specifically it's Mars, which is appropriate. should listen to that. Because it is good. I mean, I understand why they do it on synth, because if you play it and you're not doing a pre-recorded one, you don't have to worry about the copyrights of uh, somebody else's version. Yeah. Oh, I see. You beam them 
the right, then take them over ship. to the ships. And you can carry up to three at a time. Yeah, and there are ships that need one, two, or three uh, people, mm -hmm. so... And at the end, when we get to the final to, one, you can... Try to fill up the three ones first if you can. Yeah. At the end, you'll be able to transport them back to the starbase, but not until the end. Three stages of saving people. Because we always do things in three in Star Trek. There's and always three rounds of bad guys, or five. And then comes the whole escape route defense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the Which, end. by the way, when you're down to the last transport, you stop defending that thing and let the Saints kill it, just so that the round ends faster. Um, well, it, sometimes it gets stuck. Getting, it's sometimes. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it gets stuck. Well, it's still uh, getting stuck every time, so... Yeah, it's been sticking every time I've done it. It didn't stick the first time I did. Yeah, the first time was fine. The second time it stuck. The third time I couldn't... We couldn't unstick it. And once we finally got it killed, it still wouldn't end. Yeah, the, when the one transport dies, you then get uh, two more little waves of ships you have to defend. The cruisers and the... Uh... Battleships, yeah. Yeah. Unless you, and... don't rescue, unless you don't rescue any here, then. But that wouldn't take too long to do. I still haven't set up the uh, trace yet. What, me? Yep. Yeah, I've got the trace set up. I'm just... They're better than they were. I still gotta tweak them a little bit more. And I've got them hidden so I don't see them. They obscure too much of my scene. Oh, okay. So when I'm resetting yeah, them, I'll leave them out there and play with it and see what's going on. But during the mission, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm only watching three of the uh, ten trace, too, but... Uh... Yeah. For this one, there's not a lot I need to do. Not till the later battles. Then it comes in handy. Pardon? We actually want one of our uh, one of our apples is somewhat of a traitor. Oh. Actually, she's a she. And why is she a traitor? Because she has started to play something else that is not Star Trek. Oh, I would have to. Oh. What is she playing that uh, Star Trek related? She's playing GTA. Oh, GTA. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, so I, I don't you think we should put the ban a ban hammer on her. I know she, she's probably not even listening. Oh no, I don't think she is. I haven't seen her all day. She's playing GTA or Red Dead Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> I would have been less disappointed to hear that if the game in question was Star Wars The Old Republic. Then I'd be like, oh, okay, the this is is still sci-fi. And, and you didn't beam him over. Yeah, it's never any story if you can watch. Since I'm doing any proton damage, did I see that right? Pardon? Since I do anti-proton damage? Yeah. 
Yeah, I think. Was the Japan type even invent invented back then? That sure. is an excellent question, but sure, why not? I mean, by someone else other than the wall. Anti proton beams did exist back then, yeah. It was anti proton back in the original series, so. Okay. Uh -huh. Doomsday Machine ha used pure anti proton beam. That's a good point, it did. I'm, I'm slowly reporting all of these people or these bots spamming the chat. Actually, I can see some of them has been deleted. And on Deep Space Nine, the Gemidar used anti proton beams to decloak our, uh, yeah, decloak the uh, Defiant. Hmm? Yeah, using it as an, uh, essentially uh, unfocused emission, sure. They still used it. Yeah, that's like saying you use radio, now you have, ra now you have a gamma ray laser. Um, there's a difference. No, they still use it, therefore they exist. Yeah, but as I said, that's like using uh, um, radio the and... It wasn't that they use it for weapons, so they exist. That was your idea. <laughs> Uh, if it uh, existed, it existed. Oh, they're gonna pop up. They're all standing around the the base. Mm -hmm. I mean, okay, so this last round, I think you can take them over to this star base. I see two more ships here. We're almost out of ships to bring survivors to. Bring any additional crews to the station and beam them over. It's only a matter of time before the defense net destroys everything on the surface. I do love that for all reflection. <laughs> Beam up any remaining survivors and get them to the safe zone. Yeah, Burgess, you said that already. Thank you for calling me again. Oh, you're quite welcome. Sure. Come on. Oh, is it even doable to complete the rest of all of the ships? Um, with fast enough ships and a good team, maybe. If you very clearly define which persons met in which area and what what not, then maybe. Yeah, it is possible. Yeah. Difficult, which is a nice thing. There's not a transport. Okay, we're working better than group. Hold on, we're... Back to the 
I think I actually don't gonna take a risk and stay outside and see how much damage I take. Yeah. Yeah, that cup doing it freezes at 97 or something. No, it was just not that not just So let's see how the damage is. Okay. <laughs> the worst case, I die. Oh god. All ships, total defense net corruption is imminent. Ensure as many transports escape the area as possible. Form a tight perimeter. Yes. Oh, I lost half a hit points. Hmm, let's see. Okay, I'm full again. Yeah, I noticed that. <laughs> I don't think it can kill me. <laughs> That's hilarious. Actually, I think it's getting so stronger, so... <laughs> yep, now it's I've almost done 29%. Yeah, it's getting stronger. The first two were... The first one took me down to 55. Mm -hmm. The second one to 50. The third one to 45. The fourth one to 29. So, yeah. I was wondering in these uh, evacuation situations, why, not the, why aren't they all leaving together? It would be way safer. Yeah, these ships are just crawling, aren't they? Mm hmm. Yeah. Everybody's spawning there and watching. No matter where you are. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's still the next annoying pet comes out. Yep. Transport en route to both Alpha and Gamma beacons. Yeah, I don't think that is an issue, dude. So, I like annoying pets. At least in the game, I do. Oh, there's no there's pets, yeah. Transport are headed to all three Everyone beacons. just keeps them up, that's... So Ed is running more sims, right? Yes, he is. He's doing more sims because we're still going to have to finish up the last two wow. upgrades. Active. Combined with the old refraction, it's going to kill a party. <laughs> well, I never saw somebody bought my up in the alien. Someone bought that? I think they did. Oh man. I feel sorry. I, I hope it buys myself. Oh, okay. I think somebody bought it. Somebody bought the car for that. Well, guys, I'm gonna turn myself in. Okay. Have a night, bye. Oh, it was so nice to hear your voice again. Okay, I really. 
Yeah. You said you were going to turn yourself into something, so I just figured you're going to... You can't turn himself, turn himself into a pie. He's already a pie. I know, he's already a pie. Yeah. Look at this pie. Quick, 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 <laughs> Thank you for the cake pie. Okay. No, the cake is pie. Well, it says one transport's left. I don't see it. Okay, this. There it is. It's over in beta. Still, I want more soon. Not enough fireworks. Oh, please don't be stuck down there, Mr. Transporter. We're gonna have to let you die. Uh, and it looks like he's stuck. Uh, yeah, we're, we got Transporter the, stuck. We're not on the path. Oh, yep. So let's go to the other side and kill some there. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't gravel. I might. Huh. I don't know. Should he gravel over by him and see if it brings everybody to him? Oh, hey, that's an idea. Hang on. All right, where is he at? He's in beta, close to the star base. Didn't run into me. I wasn't even. On, I was barely. I wasn't even really in the path. Oh, he's 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 up with the one that's not in the path. Yeah, he's right yeah. here. Enough. It's at 57%, so... Yeah, I put my gravel right on top of it, so I'm hoping the explosions from the sense will destroy it. It's kind of mean that we're doing it. I mean... He's gonna die. It's his fault. It's like the captain of the Kobayashi Maru. Maybe that's who it is. Oh my god, he's got a job. Someone actually gave him another transport. Oh, shit. Okay, he died. Alright. Now, like it says, disengage at once. But it still goes for a while. Yeah. Because, uh, that's because bigger ships are bugging me out now. I'm still graveling, so, um. Just staying here for and it will. Or will. Well, that plasma storm staying for a really long time. <laughs> I think it was two of them. Okay. Because I've got one, but there was one that didn't. Someone had said someone else up. Uh... Just a question, how many people are using the Uru Fraction uh, anti-protons? Uh, not me. So no, only one and myself? Yep, are... just us. Yeah, because there's a lot of red beams. <laughs> yes. I'm, ru uh, I'm running various phasers, so... Uh, none of them are red. Uh, I have one red. Oh, oh. oh my Terran beam's red, so... Sorry, my one Omni is a bubble. Uh, my one Omni is the uh, Artok one. Okay. What do I have? I've got... I tend to forget I have weapons to begin with. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. The other night, 19 marks for this isn't bad. The other night, doing random, someone asked me on stream, "What wow. torpedoes are you using?" Oh, yeah, oh yeah, I have torpedoes on me. <laughs> right. Um. Uh, gee, I I, yeah, I've got, I've got Nausicaa torpedo, Nausicaa. Ray, Integrity right. Link, uh, Focus Link Omni, Health of Martok Omni, and Terran Task Force Disruptor. So it looks, so I got a variety of colors coming out of my ship, but they're all disruptors. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I wish you could actually got, send the uh, visuals for the weapons. Me, I got Terran Phaser, Pulse Phaser, Quantum Phase Beam, Omni Phaser. Inhibiting Omni Phaser, 
and a couple more pulse beams. Could we get a visual slot on the ship for weapon slot for weapon graphics? I wish we could. If we did that, I'd have. I probably would because my enduring chip. I probably have like an advanced or a TO. I'd have an advanced phaser, so they're all blue. That'd be cool. <laughs> Personally, I think it's. I think it makes it more interesting. I mean, you the don't need to use. I think uh, having a, that as a visual slot would be nice because you can just skip using it if you don't like the visual mm -hmm. to be unified. Yeah. But if you got uh, like a rainbow, otherwise. Just yep. because of like the way we build this. I um, like the temporal. I for love example. the temporals. But I actually meant uh, having each weapon uh, on your ship being a different, uh, mm -hmm. from a different set and therefore having different um, visuals. But they're all the same damage type. So just slap one item in the visual slot and everything looks the same. That would be awesome. Hey mom, can you check something for me? Sure, what do you need? Uh, on your promotional tab, is everything listening that you ever got is available? From Zen Store? Yeah, Zen Promotional. It's me. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's been uh, going on since yesterday or today? Wow. Tuesday. It's been going on since Tuesday, I just didn't... Yeah, I noticed that. Oh. Unable to complete transaction. Yeah, you can't reclaim anything there. It's just... It's just an error. <laughs> yeah. It would be fun to, to reclaim all those XP boosts on all your characters. Let's max them up and then fill that lithium to a couple million. <laughs> I wouldn't mind claiming my spec 10 spec points. That'd be nice. Yeah, I'd love to be able to reclaim those. That'd be great for my Gorn. I mean, wait for every one of my characters. Oh my god. Oh yeah. I reclaimed it and I got two of my T6 ship coupons. <laughs> <laughs> Can you reclaim it again? I uh, don't know. That's an excellent question. <laughs> I mean, why not go, go for broke? What did you reclaim? An epic package that I had... Uh, sit here again it's gone now it's not showing up here anymore at all epic package yeah <laughs> would have been fun if you wow. could, could reclaim more of them <laughs> so have um, fun with your, well, heck, your six heck let's go and see what's up on another account it's just having uh, off chance or no, I gotta figure out which one of my characters I should claim this elite star, star services pack since that's just a really, since that's just a big ton of freaking inventory slots. Huh. I could use some of those. I'll do the Alienware thing. Sign up there and get that. We had it earlier today. Yeah, I tried. It doesn't let me log in. Temporal Agent Operations Pack. I think I'll do it on. I think I would do it on my Andorian because he barely, because he has almost everything's nearly f filled completely. So. Yeah. Anyways, um, it's getting kind of late. Yes. It's yes, it is. Almost four a.m. Yes, it is. <laughs> that's <laughs> not late. That's early. Okay. By definition, yes. That's yeah. Early. Yeah. That. Well, some people are just getting up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Still, four a.m. is definitely not. Uh, the best of times. <laughs> well, we had the best of times because you were here. So, there. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for being here. That was fun. Thank God. Yeah, uh -huh. It was fun seeing your you, uh, seeing you little uh, Telluride in action. Yeah. I really love that reflection of the uh, of those weapons. Oh, yeah. yeah. Two are usable on... Uh... Well, basically, it's my Terran, so... Yeah, that fits quite well visually, but I really like using it on a tank simply for the gameplay mechanics. Just annoy everyone. And the one behind them. And the one behind that. Because the the uh, biggest issue that I got as a tank is range. I simply can only uh, 
get aggro on, on things that are within my weapon range normally. But with the reflection, I can get stuff uh, aggro on stuff that is within my weapon range. Plus another tank burst around that. Plus another tank burst around that. So yeah, it helps. <laughs> yes, yes indeed. All right, let's see what happens here. Okay. Well, I thought it was going to give me some goodies here, but... Yeah, I did. No. Well, that starter pack I got from Alienware, I claimed it on my Endorian. I now have inventory slots again. Yay! Hey. Yeah, I gotta figure out what I'm <laughs> gonna do for inventory. Problem is, I problem is, I pick up all these freaking kit modules and everything else that I don't want to get rid of. It's sort of like, and then they just sit in places, and it's like, I gotta get rid of this. <laughs> wow. I mean, if you give me a list, I can tell you which ones I can... Uh, after, <laughs> um, Let's just let's say which ones are still optimal. Yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> yeah, and, then the... course, and then of course comes all the commodities that I save up so I can sell off at some point. Why not do it right when you get them? Because I'd rather sell off a big ch I'd rather sell them off in chunks like two hundred and fifty or something like that for a lot more. Yeah. Uh, That's okay. I'm just dumping them on the NPC. Because for me, it's just not worth uh, selling them on the exchange. Yeah. Takes too much time. Too much effort. I would suggest, by the way, go uh, through what, those uh, promotional things and see what opens for you, because I just got another thing to open. <sighs> Sweet. You got another tier 6 token? No, no, this was an additional uh, number of bank slots and inventory slots. <laughs> okay. So it's well, actually random because, stuff. That's because you yeah. did the alienware thing, Mom. No, I, I haven't opened the alienware thing yet. Uh. All right, first time <laughs> buyer pack. We're gonna try it. See Next. if that works for you. Unable. All right. Duty officer pack. I have no idea where that came from, but heck. Negative. Oh wait. Oh no no. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, sixth anniversary prize vouchers, because I'll totally do those. Wow. Oh, can't get those. Okay. Two large XP boosts. That's worth a try. Nope. Oh. Uh, Neil Falcon here. I've already known I've got one. So. Mm -hmm. All the ones you've already accepted, you can't accept again. <clears throat> I just accepted one that I'd already accepted. Except it. Some aren't, but some are. It's very weird. Okay. It's exceptional. Yes. <laughs> In all Wait. the different uh, meanings of the world. Anyways, have a good evening, all, all of you. Thank you so much for Is being it here. giving out the stuff? It gave me one f on two different accounts. Go oh. figure. Russell, right, so have a great night. It. Sleep well. Or great morning. Sleep well. It was yes, worth thank trying. You guys. Thank you. It's worth trying if it's any chance that it's going to work. Well, I did try, but it didn't work. <laughs> Perfect world account link. I don't know what the reward was from that again. Perfect world account link was the con uniform, I think. I think so. It was something. I... The Gamato was what it was. Oh, it didn't come up. It didn't the give little, it to me anyways. The little orange monkey. It didn't give it anyways. Doesn't matter anymore. Alright, moving on to something... Nope. That one is still on. Oh yeah, no, that stays on forever, don't it, doesn't it? Definitely not paying 29000 <laughs> No. Yeah. Well, I have the mental wherewithal and the time for one more short something. Does anybody have anything they need to do? We got all uh, my stuff done. I don't have to do anything, but I'm game for... More murdering stuff. Nice. Okay. I'm I'm up for last TFO. 
Uh, let me go change over to science and murder okay. some stuff with science, too. Let me switch tunes. Time for Cardassian murder of, with science. What do we want to do? I think what would be quick and easy. Well, we have enough big right, guns here, we can make anything quick them. and easy if we're in space. Yeah, I was going to say. We did the hive in under three minutes, so. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I can go to Jason, we can annihilate a hive yeah, onslaught. Why don't we do another one of those speed hive onslaughts? I actually uh, uh, demo recorded one of them, and there's so many explosions that it doesn't actually look good for a demo record. <laughs> it's just everything that's uh, going to explode. Um, I'll bring, okay, I'll bring Jason and his shit back out. I'll bring out my tank. All right, if you'd like to join us for a Hive Onslaught, give me an X in chat. Well, you know I'm in, so... That's four of us. We could do a pug and some poor slub is going to get dragged along with us while everything explodes. <laughs> mm -hmm. I've only flying to this one. Going, this is the easiest one I ever did. <laughs> Boom. Done. Wow. Is it always this easy? Oh, yeah. No. It's always this easy. Anybody else out there like to join us for last one? I can do. Oh, yep. well, there we go. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. Let's try that again. Okay, it says player not found. What? For Mike. Totally found him. Right there in the chat. Yeah. Maybe he had logged. Yeah, he must have logged off. Or he's on KDF, maybe? No, he logged off. He's logged back on. There he is. Oh. Uh, there we go. Oh. You're back. Oh, oh, oh. Under Farah. All right. Let's cue this puppy up. Is it Farah or Defara? Or Defara. Or Defara. Live, Defera. From, live from the Defara. It is the Dark Bomb Consortium with, her, with your host, Rondo Moogie. Fleet Moogie, please. You're right, Fleet Moogie. Yeah. Fleet Moogie. We gotta write. We gotta write a bunch of these down just for, to have you in various locations. We will. Because I, I can probably do this every every night, but we just gotta have it kind of done. <laughs> yes. Yes. Well, I'm here working um, on the book from six till eight, at least four nights a week. Speaking of which. Chapter three is about halfway done. If you want to take a look at it, now yeah, quarter of the way done. On shields, I'll start, ta I'll start taking a look at stuff because mm -hmm. I've been tomorrow. I gotta go out and deal with some stuff, and yeah, I've been neglecting my book. Hmm. Yeah. I have so many things I haven't gotten around to doing. A growing batleth. Yes, there's a nano pulse batleth. Yeah. I did not know that. Or, Jason, you're doing drugs every, again. <laughs> every winter. Goes with the new... I've uh, never done drugs in my life. And we told you this last like time, dude. You got, no, no, no. You gotta start taking those pills, man. You're seeing things. No? Okay, fine. Oh, that's what you just say. You talking about my seizure medicine? <laughs> yeah. Other, yeah, other pills. Yeah. I was just trying to make a joke. No. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Don't make it all serious all of a sudden. No. Eight, seven, six, five, five four, three, two, two, one. And good evening, you, Lord Sepulchre. Right in time to watch things die. You will have strength of purpose. Turning, 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 turning. Need to turn faster. There you go.
Yeah, pretty much make sure it's gonna be dead before getting back. Yep, I'm on. Just in, explosion start. In case you needed to know that. We thank you for that update. Oh, you been drawing the progression from your mom. <laughs> No, so hard to see where stuff is on the screen. What? I got <laughs> no, I got hit by three warp core breaches. Wow. Views. That hurt. I can imagine. I'm telling you, both do still hurt. Yeah, they do. What's left alive? Oh, that's it. Not for long. I like how my grab walls are duplicating during the cutscene. It's impossible. Yeah. It's, uh, it's because of a duty officer I have. Yeah, I know. If you want. Let's see if we can keep the board queen from being able to fire the uh, feedback pulse. Go. I was going to take a sub major, but for some reason my sub is not going to miss half of our game. I don't think I've seen her go down that fast. She vaporized. It has yep. been happening a lot lately. Mm. I'm gonna say the runs I go in with her, that happens a lot lately, yeah. doesn't it? Well, the two plasma storms making her happy. And, and then, of course, I have approaching agony around her and a freaking, uh. The, uh, freaking, what do you call it? The anti time attack of it. Uh, Agony Sphere, is that considered an exotic particle or is it. No, it's phaser. Phaser. Okay. So all my phaser stuff buffs that. Wow. Well, that was a lot of fun. It was. Hey, Lord Sepulcher says, quote, on Triple I, bro I brought my fleet T6 Miranda out of dry dock just to see how the new Lobby Space <laughs> Weapon set would look when fired, and it's awesome. Which Lobby Space Weapon set, pray tell? That would be the NX with the phase cannons and. Really? Yeah. Yep. Sweet. The uh, phase pistol is really fun, too. I would like to see that. I don't suppose you recorded that, Lord Sepulchre, so we could all watch it. In fact, why don't you bring it out sometime and come run a mission with us? I would like to see that. I'll bring, I'll bring, how are you, how are you download triple and bring freaking Jason over there to okay. <laughs> do damage again? No problem. We'll all run over to. In fact, we should go to Triple one night and do this just for fun. Yeah. All right. Yep. Well, I'm gonna log off for the night. I have a long day tomorrow. Um, mm -hmm. I'm not streaming until Sunday night, but DT might be on. If we're on Sunday night, we'll probably be doing uh, Colony, Colony Sim. So grab your engineers, grab your medical generators, grab your photonic barriers, and all the other fun toys, and join us. So, everyone, have a great night. Um, DT, I'll talk to you later. Yep. All right, everyone. Take care. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Right. Bye-bye. Works better if I find the right switch. There it is. Bye-bye.